in the middle of Uganda. I'm here with Jesse Kizito. Jesse is one of the participating farmers of the tree adoption uh, Uganda program. And um, today I'm very privileged to, to meet him. And so, Jesse, um, can you share maybe with us uh, a little bit about your daily life? Your, what is your routine? Okay. So first of all, I woke up in the morning at around six. Uh, at around seven, I always get my breakfast. Since I'm a farmer, I go to my daily work of gardening. That work lasts for four to five hours. Then at around the midday, I come back. Then at times I also am a, a community worker. Sometimes I also, as part of my daily activities, I give something like three hours in the community. Then after that, I come back and rest. It is my, my way of life of tree, planting trees. Because I planted these ones, but all along, even before this, I've been planting. Knowing that our grandfathers used to tell us that trees conserve the environment. Without trees, everything, even the plant you are, you are planting, cannot do well. Okay? Even the, uh, the oxygen you are breathing needs trees. So I said, uh, let me also begin. If I plant a hundred or two hundred, uh, maybe in Kenya also another one plants a thousand. If you combine the whole world, you may find that this we can also drive back the desert lake condition. We planted this land uh, has a coverage of around three and a half acres. So as I told you, to be planted with a, a group of people who came from uh, a tree adoption in Uganda. I liked it because there have been some organizations giving us trees, but they could not even help you. So at the time they give you, they end up even drying under seeds. By this time, I liked the uh, adoption, okay, tree adoption in Uganda, because if I told you they are giving you trees, they go up to an extent of even planting with you. Okay? 